are we going to do? We wait. Uh, wait for what? Another sneak attack? We can't take any more risk. That will show our weakness. We need to plan our attack. That's too dangerous. We can't keep fighting with fire. We need to just wait. Are you kidding? We need to get going now. This battle will only get worse if we stay back. Klaus is right. It'll show weakness. We should make camp. Keep all the people in shelters underground so they don't get hurt. Everyone, just be quiet. We will think of something. Don't worry. But for now, I demand a town watch. Watch for signals and let me know any of the slightest news. Well, um, is there anything I can do? Misty, I know how annoyed you must be, but this is only for the best. We need to keep you locked up. Uh, locked up? Are you crazy? That's complete torture. Do you have any better ideas? I do, actually, but I'd like to spe speak to Misty about it alone. Fine. Guards, get going now. We are wasting time by the second. How are you feeling? Shocked, I guess. I can see why it's a lot to take in. I'd like to take you somewhere. Somewhere that you might like. Um, <laughs> where is it? They live just in town. They keep their home secretive. I think they could really help us. Well, you. This would be a much better option than keeping you locked up in a cell. Oh, well, that's true. Um, where are we going again? Just follow me. Welcome to the home of a witch. A, a witch? Yes, a real witch. She lives here, right in the corner of town. It doesn't look like a witch's home. It looks normal. Well, she's a secretive witch. One who doesn't share much information to anyone. Vivian, are you there? Why, hello, Alina. Oh, who's this with you? Uh, uh, this is Misty. The Misty. Oh my goodness. She's alive? She is. Here in the flesh. <laughs> Good to finally meet you. I've heard so many tales about you. Oh. <laughs> Good to meet you too. Does everyone know who I am? You're a legend. Of course they do. Oh. I mean, I don't think I'm a legend, but... <laughs> oh, but you are. So... Uh, Lena's telling me you're a witch? Uh, do you know? I am. I live here in this home. Isn't it very witch-like? Well, there's, uh, well, uh, where's all your witch supplies? It's hidden inside my house. Follow me. Here's my room, where all the magic happens, pun intended. It's very cool, wow. It's taken years to reach this point. I've been practicing magic for 10 years. Seems long, but magic can take about 50 years to be a master at it. 
Elena is the only person who knows about me. I've known her for a couple years. I told her my secret the second I knew I could trust her. We made a promise to never tell anyone about what I do unless it's you. <laughs> and, well, here you are, right in front of me. <laughs> That's really awesome. So, what do you do? I practice witchcraft. Living in Mystic Reach has been tough for me, but I have to hide my passion in order to stay safe around here. Julius bans magic, whatsoever. It sounds weird, because your own name has magic behind it, but, you know. And some other stuff that I can't talk about yet. It's okay. I get that a lot. <sighs> We're all just trying to protect you. You know that. You're the best and worst thing that's happened to you in Mystic Reach. Yeah, I've been told that one before. I see you've learned a bit about yourself. You don't realize how special you are, do you? I'm getting there. Anyways, why do you still live here if Julius bans magic? I was waiting to meet you. I had to meet you before I left. But you've met me. Now what? It's time for me to move on. I found my dream standing right in front of me, but now it's time to look for a new one. N no, don't leave. We, we, we could need your help, and, well, I might need your help. My help? For what reason? Oh, my goodness, that's awful. Do we know who did it? We don't, but they definitely want me. Hmm. We could try a cloak spell? Just stay invisible from everyone? Sure, why not? Okay, not that. Um, how about... Oh, we could teleport you when the target becomes near. How about... No? No? Okay, well... I guess I do have one more option. But it's very, very special and could have some side effects. Here, let me show you. Okay. This is my magic necklace. It doesn't have a special name yet, but it's golden. And wearing it gives you strength, power, and magic. Use it wisely, though. It can be very powerful. My grandmother wore it in her greatest battles, and it proved her very well. Uh, <laughs> I can't take this, okay? This is too much. You, you barely even know me. Misty, I believe in you. You can handle it. Out of all people, you can handle it. Maybe if I told you about its past, you'd believe me. This necklace has been used on so many great and magical people. Back in 1923, there was a heartbreaking war between King Arnold over the freedom of magic in a town known as Moon Walsh. This town was known for its magic and ability to do the impossible. My grandmother was one of them. She entered the war to fight for our freedom, and she wore this exact necklace in her battles, and it proved her well. I'm surprised it's still wearable. Anyways, the town ended up winning its freedom for magic. I've never visited the town, nor have I seen it, but it's always been a dream to me. Is that town still free? That's what I don't know yet. I'm not even sure this place is full of magic still. But I know for a fact this necklace is. I keep its magic alive every day. Just for a day like this. Why are you so sure I can handle it? I'm not my mother, I'm just a girl. Oh, but you're not just a girl. You have something that you just have not figured out yet. I promise it will come to you soon. Oh, anyways, you should probably get going. It's going to get dark out. Thank you again, Vivian. I'll treasure this necklace for my life. Good luck out there. Save yourself and protect each other. We will. <laughs> well, that was interesting. I had no idea we had witches or even magic to begin with. Huh. Magic has been around for hundreds of years. It has mainly been used for negative purposes, so Julius prohibited magic altogether. It's never been the same. How old is he? Julius? Well, he became king very young. I will say 15? 
He's going on nineteen very soon. Very young to be handling this himself. Why do you ask? Just curious, that's all. Um, did you know I'm half related to him? Of course. How does this make you feel? Me feel? Well, to know my own mother cheated on what it seems to be just such a great guy sounds a bit rough. Understandable. Have you heard about his decree? Decree? What decree? <sighs> they made a plan that once you returned, you would become queen almost immediately. Makes sense, though. You are technically the founder of the town, and you'd be a leader to these people. Wait, wait. So you're telling me I'm going to have to marry Julius? I wouldn't bet on it. They probably have forgotten or broken off the decision. Don't stress about it. If they really stuck with it, you'd be queen by now. I hope they don't make me do that. Something wrong with the king? No, no, it's just I... I don't love him. How can I marry him? <laughs> Only time will tell. Now, let's get going before they start to worry. Actually, I'm gonna stick around for a bit. I'll come back in a bit. How in the world did I get myself into another mess? Where... Where is my mother? And where is my father? And who is he? Gosh, I just, I can't wrap my head around the fact that I've been lied to my whole entire life. And that my parents aren't my real parents? What are they, my adoptive parents? I, I, well, what, why do these people want me? I didn't even do anything. I've never been here. I've never even met those people. I can't take it anymore. I didn't do anything. I'm nothing. I have nothing on me. Nothing special. Nothing that they need. So why do they need me? Oh. Oh, uh, hey, Elijah. Misty? Oh. Hey, what are, you, what are you doing here? I'm just, um, thinking to myself. I get it. Tough being the target, huh? Kinda. Hey, Elijah, I never really asked you about why those people were attacking you that night. What happened? If you really want to know, I was keeping guard, like I'm told, and when I see a threat, I do what I have to do. It just caused a riot, but these people were trying to harm the village. I couldn't let that happen. You did the right thing, defending your home. That's what I keep telling myself, and... That this is my home and I must protect it. I wish I knew where my real home was. Hey, I can help you. You know, you, you learn about your real story together. You and me. Really? You would help me? <laughs> I can see how bad you want it. It's in your eyes. I'd want to know my past too. My brother, he can help us. He's a frequent traveler. He could help you on navigation. Oh, Elijah. I really appreciate that, but it seems like a lot. How so? It's just, I'm not really ready to leave yet. It's not safe for me. It's okay, though my brother could totally help us. He studies Mystic Reach and could give you something you'd like to, to know about the place. I'd like that. Thank you. I should probably get going. They're gonna get worried. I'll see you later? Yeah. See ya. Huh. Protect yourself, Misty. I don't want to lose you either. <laughs> <laughs>